Hi everyone, today I want to share with you how I make mini pretzel dogs. I had my nephew over and he said they taste exactly like Auntie Ains pretzels. Yeah, it tastes like <clears throat> Monkey's Amy's, like the one you get in the mouth. And let's get started. At first, get one cup of warm water, about 100 to 110 degrees in Fahrenheit. Add two teaspoons of yeast. one tablespoon of sugar and one tablespoon of flour. Give that a quick stir and cover it with a plastic wrap. After about 10 minutes the batter will increase in size and you will see a foamy bubbles form. Get a big bowl and add the yeast batter. Add two tablespoons of olive oil half of a teaspoon of salt add two and a half cups of flour that's about 330 grams and start mixing until the dough gets smooth and soft and this is what I got after mixing about five minutes I'm adding some olive oil to the surface of the bowl to prevent the dough sticking. Place the dough in the bowl and cover it with a plastic wrap and let the dough proof until it doubles in size. It was really warm today in my kitchen so it took only 35 minutes but it shouldn't be no more than one hour or an hour and a half. Use some flour to prevent the dough sticking and start rolling out the dough. Cut the dough in even sticks about 3 fourths of an inch thick and the length should be about two and a half size of the sausage. Simply wrap the dough around the sausage Bring one liter of water to boil and add one teaspoon of baking soda. And when the water starts to boil, place pretzel dogs in the water for about 30 seconds. These are mini dogs, so they don't need to be long in the water. I'm doing about five or six at a time. And from the water, you'll place them on the baking tray with parchment paper or silicon mat. Repeat the same steps with the rest of the pretzel dogs. Here I have one egg, I will whisk it up. And brush the egg on top of the pretzel dogs. I'm also adding some shredded cheese. There's also another great option, you can sprinkle some salt instead of the cheese. Preheat your oven to 450 degrees and bake for about 10 minutes. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more recipes coming soon.